O Christ Jesus, when all is darkness and we feel our weakness and helplessness, give us the sense of your presence, your love, and your strength. Help us to have perfect trust in your protecting love and strengthening power so that nothing may frighten or worry us. For living close to you, we shall see your hand, your purpose, your will through all things. Amen. Lord, help me to remember that nothing is going to happen to me today that you and I together can't handle. Amen. Soul of Christ, sanctify me. Body of Christ, save me. Blood of Christ, fill me. Water from the side of Christ, wash me. Passion of Christ, strengthen me. O good Jesus, hear me. Within your wounds, hide me. Suffer me not to be separated from you. From the malicious enemy, defend me. In the hour of my death, call me and bid me come unto you, that with your saints I may praise you forever and ever. Amen. Dear Lord, teach me to be generous. Teach me to serve you as you deserve, to give and not to count the cost to fight and not to heed the wound, to toil and not to seek for rest, to labor and not to seek reward, save that of knowing that I do your will. Amen. Lord Jesus, we ask you now to help us remain with you always to be close to you with all the ardor of our hearts, to take up joyfully the mission you entrust to us, and that is to continue your presence and to spread the good news of your resurrection. Amen. Lord, help me enter into that peace which consists in having put my life in your hands. Amen. Lord, grant that I may see thee more clearly, love thee more dearly, and follow thee more nearly. Amen. Jesus, may all that is you flow into me. May your body and blood be my food and drink. May your passion and death be my strength and life. Jesus, with you by my side, enough has been given. May the shelter I seek be the shadow of your cross. Let me not run from the love which you offer, but hold me safe from the forces of evil. On each of my dyings, shed your light and your love. Keep calling to me until that day comes, when, with your saints, I may praise you forever. Amen. O Lord my God, you called me from the sleep of nothingness 
merely because in your tremendous love you want to make good and beautiful beings. You have called me by my name in my mother's womb. You have given me breath and light and movement and walked with me every moment of my existence. I am amazed, Lord God of the universe, that you attend to me and more. Cherish me. Create in me the faithfulness that moves you, and I will trust you and yearn for you all my days. Amen. Grant me, O Lord, the strength to be who I must be, to do what I must do. Give me the courage to stand strong against my fears and have the will to express my feelings and needs. Help me realize that I have the power to change, no matter what anyone tells me, because of you. Give me the faith I need to believe in you always, even when it seems you're not there. I ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. If we really want to pray, we must first learn to listen. For in the silence of the heart, God speaks. Therefore, once and for all, this short command is given to you. Love and do what you will. If you keep silent, keep silent by love. If you speak, speak by love. If you correct, correct by love. If you pardon, pardon by love. Let love be rooted in you. And from the root, nothing but good can grow. Jesus, I feel within me a great desire to please you, but at the same time, I feel totally incapable of doing this without your special light and help, which I can expect only from you. Accomplish your will within me, even in spite of me. Amen. Grant me, O Lord my God, a mind to know you, a heart to seek you, wisdom to find you, conduct pleasing to you, faithful perseverance in waiting for you, and a hope of finally embracing you. Amen. We need to find God, and He cannot be found in noise and restlessness. God is the friend of silence. See how nature, trees, flowers, grass grows in silence. See the stars, the moon, and the sun, how they move in silence. We need silence to be able to touch souls. Amen. What does love look like? It has the hands to help others. It has the feet to hasten to the poor and needy. It has eyes to see misery and want. It has the ears to hear the sighs and sorrows of men. That is what love looks like. Amen. My God, I give you this day. I offer you now all the good that I shall do, and I promise to accept, for love of you, 
all of the difficulties that I shall meet. Help me to conduct myself during this day in a manner pleasing to you. Amen. Isaiah 41 Do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be afraid, for I am your God. I will strengthen you, I will help you, I will uphold you with my victorious right hand. Matthew 11 Come to me, all you that are weary and are carrying heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your soul.